Coach, you're undefeated through four games this season. That's the first time for this program since 2007 uh, that App State soccer has been unbeaten through four games. What do you think that says about the trajectory of this program? I think we have established a strong foundation of team defense and the girls are bought into the organization and the energy that it takes to defend really well. Um, I think it's great that we've got some shutouts under our belt and we're, we're, we are tough to break down. I would like to see us start making some offensive plays and some better attacking um, connections than we have. But I think this is the foundation. If we can defend well, now we've got a lot to build on. So I'm excited about that. I think it's a good start for us. Kerry Eagleston posted her 15th career shutout on Sunday at George Mason. That moves her into third place all time. What luxury is it for you as a coach to have someone like that in goal for you? Carrie's done a great job, and she's just she's so steady back there, and she's really becoming more vocal as a leader out on the field, which we really need. Um, she deserves every shutout that she's got. She's earned them. She had a couple good saves against George Mason. She earned that shutout. Um, she's just been fantastic, and we need her to continue to be that, that steady uh, wall back there that she has been. The game prior to that on Thursday, you guys beat UT Martin 2-1. to one. First win of the season, first win for you as the head coach here at App State. What separated that game from your first couple of this season? Well, it was an exciting, it was an exciting day for us. It was, you know, under the lights. Um, I think the girls brought a lot of energy. I think, you know, another week of training under our belts as well in terms of how we're going to defend and how we're going to play together. The, the connecting was much better for us on the offensive side, and the defense was, was, was good. Um, we'd cleaned up a few things uh, that we needed to, and I think it was a really good win for us because UT Martin is a, a really respectable opponent, and I think they played well. They played hard. They had their chances, but ultimately we were all able to hold them off and get, get some goals. In that game, Anna Kate Highsmith nets the first goal of the season for this team. What does it mean for someone like her, a transfer, to come in and catch on so quickly to the point where she's starting and she's scoring goals? I think she's been a great addition to our attack. Uh, give, we've got a lot of depth in those three forward positions, and we use it um, nearly every game. And for her to come in and get a goal, I think is a huge confidence boost for her and, and bring some more firepower to our attack, which we, we definitely needed. You guys face Clemson next on Sunday. Certainly the toughest opponent on your schedule. What's the message heading into that game? The message is the same as it always is. We're going to go out. We're going to play as hard as we can. We're going to be organized. Uh, we have a few things that we're working on this week, of course, special for Clemson. But, you know, ultimately, we're not going to change who we are. There aren't going to be wholesale changes. We're going to go out and we're going to play our game and um, we're going to see where we measure up.